1st through 7th October 2022. Let's see what messages come through for you, right? Sagittarius. Okay, Sagittarius. Ace of Wands, Four of Cups, Ace of Cups, my God, this is very interesting. Okay, Sagittarius, for a lot of you, I see a decision coming your way, right? And for a lot of you, I see you leveling up to make a decision. As you enter this week, I'm picking up that a lot of new opportunities are coming your way, right? Back to back. This is going to be a phase where you might find yourself in a position and this can be romantic, this can be other way, uh, other way also, but for a lot of you, I'm picking up romantic. There's going to be a short-lived passion coming your way in the beginning. You're going to find somebody very attractive or this person finds you very attractive and it's going to be more like I'm picking up fling energy or, you know, passionate energy, but um, very quickly I see you realizing that this is not my cup of tea or my cup of coffee. I'm, uh, you know, for a lot of you, I see this is denial or rejection denial or rejection i'm not into this right this was short-lived for a lot of you this is new but it's short-lived and uh, for someone specific i'm picking up it's just you you know coming across somebody when you're going to the gym or anything like anything like uh momentary i do i think you know and getting attracted and stalking a person for a day or two looking for their information but then something comes up and you're like nah this is actually not what I'm looking for, you know? And as you are focused on this energy, which is short-lived and which probably is something that you're not looking for, something that you're looking for comes in. <laughs> That's very interesting. Ace of Cups. For a lot of you, this is a new chapter starting in your love life. Now, Ace of Cups can have different meanings. A new chapter in your current love life, a new expression of love that you were not expecting from somebody, a new start in your love life, a new person offering you love. New, old, doesn't matter, but something that is going to be like over flooding of emotions, overly expressive energy. And uh, yeah, you can feel this um, flood of emotions for somebody or vice versa. Very interesting energy, Saj. Moving forward. Oh, we're going to have fun. This is going to be an interesting week of picking up. Not first, but the second thing can be a little more emotionally fulfilling here. For some of you, this, these can be job offers also. Seven of Swords, Seven of Cups and Page of Pentacles. Now, the interesting thing here is, th is that these opportunities or these offers coming to you back to back is going to puzzle you. The situation is going to puzzle you for a moment. Now what happens is that uh, now you have to make a choice. Now you have to pick the right thing for you. What are you going to do? I see the basic reaction to this whole thing is going to be sneak away, run away for a moment, take a break. Take some time off to think about this, right? For a lot of you, I'm picking up that if you have the short lift start somewhere, and then you feel that no this is not something i want i want this your first reaction will be <laughs> little sneaky right little sneaky here you you might keep facts from somebody you might avoid some conversation here you if somebody is calling you i see you avoiding their text and um i see this person is about to call you it's by some means they can reach out to you on social media or you can get this this text and while you search about them you realize that no this is not what i want and then there's going to be a phase of confusion right if you know if not this then what seven of swords to seven of cups is showing me that this is your own conscious not consciousness i'm sorry not letting you make this decision for a lot of you i'm definitely picking up that you're keeping facts away from somebody till the time you're sure about this and eventually you're deciding to level up and analyze page of pentacles is that card of analysis where you have something in your hand and then you analyze it in and out this is the energy of having a lot of options seven of cups see four of cups seven of cups i think you're not sure about something and you need time to think about this 
Let's clarify. I see Eight of Swords under the deck. You're dealing with somebody here who is totally confused about what is happening. Eight of Swords can be your energy also where your own self-limiting beliefs are not letting you level up and accept the offers coming your way or accept, the, accept these new big names coming your way, right? These are big names, more than offers. Potential, they have potential. They can definitely start new cycles in your life provided you don't run away from them, right? And death is showing me that, yeah, there has been some transformation lately in your life. You're coming from this place. Somebody has been cold with you, Sag. It's so Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. And Five of Pentacles is showing me that um, you felt bad about it, of course. There was some kind of abandonment associated here. Let's clarify. Interesting energy, isn't it? Let's clarify. Eight of Pentacles. For a lot of you, you can find this person at your workplace. Yeah, at your workplace, Eight of Pentacles, while you're working. Somebody's getting attracted to you when they see you working. Knight of Wands. And you totally... For some of you, I'm picking up... Um, you know, it's fling. Or it is just short-lived. Knight of Wands. This person is watching you. I see this person has a crush on you from a very long time. Knight of Cups. For some of you, I see two people here. Knight of Cups, Ace of Cups, Knight of Wands, Ace of Wands. There are two people approaching you together. This week, you might hear from two different people. And Two of Pentacles is your struggle card. What should I do? One is probably at your workplace, Sag. And you are rejecting this person because I don't think you are convinced. Um... Yeah, Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy for a lot of you. For a lot of you, this is like um, setting boundaries. And uh, for someone specific, I'm picking up that because this person is at your workplace or the place where you're known for your skills, you don't want uh, any fling to get popular there. You want to set boundaries. You want to make logical decisions here. And Lovers is showing me definitely choices. And then there is Ace of Cups. What is this Ace of Cups? King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Energy. And then something new comes in. Interesting. And see, you have a choice to make two of Pentacles. Definitely have a choice to make. You're comparing both the choices here, right? For some of you, I'm picking up a new start. Potential new start is heading your way with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Or this person is definitely uh, practical and they have some solid offer for you. Not really wishy-washy or in the air. But you're not convinced about something. Yeah, For a lot of you, I see you don't want something to lead to third party situation. Three of Pentacles is showing me that you want, you know that something has to end. One of the two things have to end. And... Uh, Something that is stable is uh, something you're going to work over, right? Ten of ten of Swords, Nine of Pentacles. Now there is an offer here. Now there is an offer that's making you happy. Potentially a relationship, see? Four of Wands, Sun, Four of Wands, Ten of Cups. Possible offer here. For some of you, I'm picking up uh, uh, if this is a workplace romance. See, Eight of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. If you're having some workplace romance... Sagittarius or if you uh, find yourself in a situation where there is a co-worker has a big crush on you <laughs> so I see you are trying to avoid this situation trying to avoid the situation because you're confused about what to do here seven of cups oh queen of pentacles but the thing is that you're definitely avoiding somebody at your workplace. That's what I'm getting here. But then you find something which is unavoidable. Because you see somebody as your potential partner. Sometimes we have some rules at the workplace or, you know, in our neighborhood. Or you don't like dating people in your surroundings. Or you, you want to set boundaries. Um... You know, we have this thought process that people like to keep their personal life very private. You know, and uh, there are fears sometimes what is going to happen if this becomes public. But this King and Queen of Pentacles is showing me that 
you might find out of the options again not options i'm sorry out of the choices you have you can find somebody as your long term partner you can you see partnership even potential life partner here right so you you have a you have a connection here or a connection is coming in you see this as long term partnership right and for some of you i see the conversation surrounding that can move forward right yep so let's see i see some messages coming in from this energy here some messages coming in from this energy and you are confused what to do because you are so amazed so surprised to see this person and the kind of behavior for some, for some of you i'm picking up this is kind of uh, this if this is a new person you'll be amazed to see them because they are showing some characteristics they're showing some traits which are going to mesmerize you and you're like oh my god i always wanted my future spouse to be like that right so you'll be surprised to see their um, behavior body language the courtesy this is very much like gentleman energy here and uh, ace of wands yeah i see the surprise here see and then four of pentacles i don't think you are opening up to it as of now but these encounters are wow <laughs> let's have some additional messages it's going to be your free will how you deal with these options these opportunities coming your way i do see potential one is something you know is short-lived and just a fling or a crush so you're going to be ignoring it for a lot of you i do see because you don't want any kind of work-life drama but then something here is uh, you know something is some something is something you can't avoid <laughs> it makes sense sagittarius additional messages for sagittarius courthouse yeah for some of you i see um a lot of uh, mingling up is happening here you know it's like mixing up is happening here at your workplace for some of you i see you are afraid of some legal action sometimes you know uh, by legal action this can be if you're working in a in an office and uh, there's some decorum required to be maintained and you know that if you entertain any such energy this can have repercussions so you're trying to avoid this energy right for some of you i see this can this can possibly impact your promotion or your image in front of your bosses so there's something like that i'm picking up if it's a work life thing and then unexpected income is showing me that you just want to focus on work because i see money rising here queen of pentacles king of pentacles stability coming in what else any additional message for sag expectation sag now you're going to be amazed you're going to be hearing from somebody this is possibly this energy i'm picking up house this false person okay for some of you you might hear that uh, the person who is uh, attracted to you at your workplace and eventually you're finding out that this person is already married and you're like what the fuck <laughs> this person was trying to hit on me from the first day and now i'm getting the message that this person is already married but anyways this new thing starting here ace of cups it is something that you always expected it is something that you always wanted and now when something like that comes in front of you you're going to be surprised you know so i do feel this is going to be interesting i see a message coming in now you see how you want to take it it's going to be free will very interesting let's have some additional messages for sagittarius a lot of new excitement coming your way sag a lot of new excitement coming your way sagittarius sun moon rising venus and jupiter I want to know. Okay, let's get more clarity on this. Awakening. For some of you it's like uh, you getting to know about this energy. You have been working over your own stuff and then suddenly you hear that somebody wants to take action towards you. Somebody is definitely bringing action here. When you're getting awakened about for some of you I'm actually picking up that you're going to hear that somebody who has been flirting around with you for a very long time or somebody who has been hitting on you and you were avoiding this person you get to know that this person is already married and uh, there is a thought there is a fear that this can tarnish your image 
in the surroundings so you're trying to maintain some distance from this person passion but then something comes in that is so beautiful support see king and queen of pentacles is definitely the partnership you were always expecting okay where is the situation heading expect a miracle message i definitely feel sad that the kind of this kind of partnership that is coming your way i don't really see it's a partnership as of now because i see this is something in process or under process right now this week or this month you can meet this person i don't know whether you already know this person or not but you're going to have a close encounter with this person you might go on a coffee date or something like that and the kind of behavior body language or gestures they're going to show is something that's going to make you feel wow you know surprised and you're going to feel that oh this is something i always wanted so that's going to even mess up with your mind more because probably you were just avoiding love situations in your life and when something like this comes in it's so hard to avoid right so i'll leave you here sanj thank you so much guys for watching bye bye take care